What's going on guys? It's your boy PTK Blam back in the building with another weekly video. Yes guys, it is that time again. Today is Wednesday and I'm back with a bunch of content. Got a lot to talk about today. First off, I just want to send a huge, huge, huge shout out to everybody that comes to the channel. If you're here for your first time, come in, come in, make yourself comfortable. Drop a like on the videos, watching videos while you're here as well. Leave a comment or two. That's awesome. I love to react uh, with the actual subscribers. It's amazing. I enjoy doing it. I do it as often as I possibly can, as well as subscribe to the channel, the most important thing. So that way you continue to see great videos on the channel, guys. So I am going to be making some quick changes. So I got a quick announcement here on the channel, guys. So I know I've been kind of doing and uploading these weekly videos sporadically the last two or three weeks, but I'm going to put myself on a schedule. I will now. I'll be uploading videos Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and podcasts on Saturday. So that is now the actual live video schedule. So you guys lock that into your calendars. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. That way, when I do release a video, you guys know exactly the second that it comes out. Okay. So let's dive right into the topic. I cannot wait any longer. So you guys know we've been talking about this XO event for the last probably shit since the announcement came out actually and we've been super excited as xbox fans and the news just keeps getting better and better now i don't really have anything definitive to talk about but it's a lot of little small things that xbox is doing right now they are on fire so today the financial report came out about how every part of microsoft is doing and the xbox division is up a whole almost 50 percent like 45 percent 44 to be exact i think which means Xbox is growing. Um, hardware sales are up like 80, 90%. It's something crazy. So essentially, guys, Xbox is not going anywhere. They've made the right proper chess moves to put themselves in this position. Now, news like that is coming at this current time. Prior to XO, I'm hearing all kinds of things like crackdown potentially rising from the rubble. There was this tweet earlier today. Shout out to the boy Showstopper. He put it out that it was in Spanish, I believe, pretty much saying that before crackdown was about they kind of pitched it as a hundred percent destructible environment online that may be something that they're actually able to pull off now which would be insane because crackdown is a game that's been delayed delayed and delayed and we were worried that the version we're going to get now is not going to be anywhere near what they promised so it's actually really nice to hear that we stay still may be getting something close to what they talked about initially uh, as well as a uh, shout out to the boy jazz he tweeted out uh maybe an hour ago that Probably, I think it was this morning, actually, but that there was some devs, a lot of marketing team were hanging out at Ninja Theory headquarters. So are we going to see an event from Ninja Theory, or an event, but an actual uh, something at the XO event from Ninja Theory? Potentially, maybe. I mean, I hear that, you know, when they were making Hillblade, that required only 20 people. So the other 80 people were working on something else. And that's that's facts. We all know that, that they were doing something else. We don't know what it is, how far along the actual game is, but I'm hoping... We're going to see something come out of the XO event. This news is getting better and better and better, and I cannot wait. I believe it is November 11th. Literally about two weeks, we'll be able to see what's going on. I feel like we're going to get a ton of surprises. Obviously, the studio acquisition, uh, the whole Obsidian acquisition that apparently leaked, that the whole deal is like 90% done. We haven't really heard anything since then. It's kind of gone dark, but we're going to smoke this fire. So I'm, I'm gonna still going to keep all my, you know, feelings in check because i don't want to get too ahead of myself but guys every day there's something we're seeing all this positive energy all this positive momentum that xbox has going into this xo event this could be really 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 huge for the brand if they knock this out the park and i fully expect phil and company to get up on stage and kill it okay so as a fan of xbox i have been you know since i got the og xbox i just love to see them being aggressive i also love to see them doing what they're supposed to be doing their fan engagement listening to fans everything across the board they're firing on all cylinders everybody and it's amazing to see and i thank sony for that i thank nintendo for that as well i thank xbox fans for that because we put xbox feet to the flames in certain situations yeah we bitch we moan some of us nitpick some of us do the fanboy shit but honestly if you're a real gamer all you want is the best experience for the console you play or whatever console you may own and I love the fact that Xbox has always came back to the fans and said, hey, I know things are not going the way we want, but we got things right. And I think that's what Phil was doing. And I think that all this news coming out, whether it may be speculative or actually confirmed true, I just think it's all good press and it's all good vibes for Xbox going into an event that they haven't had in a long time. 
I mean, this is the only event we've had separate from E3 or Gamescom this entire generation. So this is extremely exciting as an Xbox fan, as a gamer in general. You should be really happy about the gaming industry. Spider-Man crushed the MPD for Sony. Um, Forza performed very well. I'm probably going to make a separate video about Forza because I'm really excited about that. Um, so just all in all, everything is up across the board. I'm really excited. I'm dying as we need the, the days leading up to this. We got we don't have a lot of time, guys. We got 12, maybe 15, 16 days till at till the actual event. We don't have a ton of time, and I'm so excited because I feel like something prior to that event is going to happen. We're going to get an announcement. We may get a leak or something. That tends to happen with things like this, but hopefully they can hold off. Xbox has been pretty good about keeping things under wraps. But you guys let me know if you guys are excited for this event. What do you guys think about the recent news, even though it's not all confirmed news? What do you think I was thinking about the fact that the Xbox division is up year over year in every single category? It's amazing, guys. I'm really excited about it. So let me know what you guys think down in the comment section. Um, also, once again, like, subscribe for more content, more videos. Guys, the Shop Podcast this Saturday will be super lit. I have a special guest. Uh, check out Ashen Luca. That is her name. Uh, she has her. She runs her own podcast. It's called The Scumcast. Just type that in the search on YouTube. You guys will find it. She does a great show. I'm a big fan. I've always been a watcher of that uh, podcast. She has great panel, great topics. She's a great leader as well. Great host, I mean. So you guys come check us out this Saturday. Make sure you bring a friend, all right? So I'll holler at you guys later. More videos coming soon. Next video dropping this Friday, guys. Have a good one. Peace out.